Hey guys, this is Gavin with First World Survival. Today I'll be showing off a couple of my toys, my bow, my blow darts, and my crossbow. So for the first part of this video, I'm going to be shooting my homemade blow darts at balloons and soda cans. Alright, so now I'm going to be testing one of my thicker darts against a soda can. It got me. Look what it did to these cans. I honestly didn't think the darts would be able to do it. But one of the scary parts you got to be careful is they shoot back when you hit something that explodes. I've had it happen with the cans and um, balloons. You also don't have to use a dart gun for your darts. You could also use them kind of like this. First I'll be shooting at one of these cans. Fuck, I need more arrows. <laughs> cool. <laughs> First try! So it's pretty amazing, I skewered it on my first try, didn't have to take any other cuts, I think I did a really good job, completely destroyed the can, so I know my bow works actually really well, and my aim is perfect too, so I guess that's another good thing. Alright, so I'm going to do a Coke and Mentos, I'm going to shoot at it, and it's supposed to blow up, I've never done this before, so I'm just going to put the whole thing in, if I'm fast enough. Let's see. Oh gosh. Does anyone know how to do this? Maybe not the whole thing, but. Okay, that's getting solid. I'm gonna go shoot at it before, before it blows itself up. That wasn't that cool. I got kind of boring results from the last one, so I'm gonna try again. I'm putting six Mentos in. Let's hope it's more exciting. That was pretty cool. You can keep it rolling. So here's what it did. Still wasn't that cool. I was kind of disappointed. But at least the arrow went straight through. It's probably going to leak out a lot more when I pull it. No? I don't know what I did wrong here. But either way, it's kind of a cool target to shoot at. Would be a lot cooler if it worked. It does taste like Mentos, which I like. It adds a good minty flavor to it. This is a new drink, basically. That was pretty cool. So next I'm going to be shooting the crossbow. Um, I'd say it's more of a novelty item. Doesn't shoot that great, but it's kind of cool to build, cool to have, looks cool. Um, just lock it up like this. Then I have a trigger at the bottom I just pull out. And it has a lot of power to it. Just um, a lot of friction going against the arrow. First shot. Was the first try. So as you could see, the crossbow's problem 
I wouldn't say it's the power, I'd say it's the aim and the convenience of it. Loading it up takes a while, but it has enough power to send the fletching all the way through the can. Maybe if it was a different object, it would have gone all the way through. So I'm actually a lot happier with it than I thought I was. Well, this was my first time shooting a can. Very happy with the results. First shot. So I'd say that the bow, I'm kind of, it shoots well, but I'm not a good shot with it, so obviously it's not as fun for me as the blow darts, which I really love. And then the crossbow is more of a novelty item. It's cool, it has a lot more power than I was expecting, but it's kind of inconvenient to load up. And I mean, what good is a bow when you can't hit anything with it? But blow darts are really cool. I could hit something 50 feet right exactly where I wanted, very precise. The only problem is you lose the darts a lot and it's kind of a nail with um, paper wrapped around it so you don't want to lose those. Good. That's it for today. Remember to like, watch, and subscribe. Also check me out at firstworldsurvival.com. I have a newsletter I put together with a lot of people in the survival community, really cool articles. I really recommend checking it out. Get a spit so, take in there. So good.